Uh, you'll recall just a couple of days ago, Donald Trump, in addressing the opioid crisis, had this to say about uh, his commission's recommendation that he call for a state of emergency, which will allow funds to be dispersed uh, to deal with the really um, serious uh, crisis we have of opioid abuse in this country. This is what Donald Trump had to say. The way to prevent drug addiction and overdose is to prevent people from abusing drugs in the first place. If they don't start, they won't have a problem. If they do start, it's awfully tough to get off. So we can keep them from going on, and maybe by talking to youth and telling them no good, really bad for you in every way. But if they don't start, it will never be a problem. Uh, apparently, there was some pushback to that. And or, I mean, look, one of the reasons why it, uh, it occurred to me that he would be holding back from releasing those funds, and, and remember, these are emergency funds that um, ride on top of the, the budget. So you get funds uh, that can be appropriated. If you designate it an emergency, you get funds to be appropriated in excess of caps that have been put on there uh, via the sequester or whatnot. Um, and they can just be re released. You wouldn't have to worry about, you know, the, the Freedom Caucus or anything like that, that type of situation. It's my understanding, anyways. Um, and my uh, thinking was at the time, well, maybe they're holding back on this because Mitch McConnell wants that money or somebody else or the White House was thinking that money we're going to use to bribe, you know, uh, Portman and Shelley Moore Caputo. But... Uh, that plan seems to be put by the wayside because he changed his mind. He realized, maybe after talking to somebody, that, um, oh, it's, it's saying it's bad is not enough? Oh, here we go. Mr. President, Let's is the opioid crisis an emergency? And if so, why haven't you declared The opioid crisis is an emergency, and I'm saying officially right now it is an emergency. <laughs> it's a national emergency. We're going to spend a lot of time, a lot of effort, and a lot of money on the opioid crisis. But you need emergency powers to address it. We're going to draw it up and we're going to make it a national emergency. Uh, it is a serious problem, the likes of which we have never had. You know, when I was growing up, they had the LSD and they had certain generations of drugs. There's never been anything like what's happened to this country over the last four or five years. And I have to say this, in all fairness, this is a worldwide problem, not just a United States problem. This is happening worldwide. But this is a national emergency, and we are drawing documents now to so attest. So, I mean, now, it very well could be that that will be the last we hear of it. Uh, but, you know, if it is the case, good for him. Hi, folks. Sam Cedar here. We still need your help on our Patreon page. YouTube ads have come back, but not nearly as much as we had before. So if you can help us out, any little bit helps. Head over to our Patreon page right at this URL, and you'll help us keep helping you by making videos.